ho ho guys, welcome back guys to a brand new Christmas review here on the channel today. It's your boy Charlie Scent Ninja here and welcome guys to another Christmas review. Before I start up with this Christmas review, Christmas with you guys. If you guys are excited for this with you, make sure you guys go down below and hit that like button down below. Let's maybe maybe we can get this video to five likes. That would be amazing. Also, if this is the first time here, then click that subscribe button down below. I need you guys' help. I'm trying to get this channel to uh, three thousand subscribers by June eighth, twenty twenty four. So if you guys can help me out, that would be amazing. Also hit that notification bell to never miss when I upload a video. Also share this video with your friends and the family. And make sure you guys go down below, go subscribe to my two other channels. Link is in the description down below. So in our last uh, Christmas review, I reviewed you guys uh, Jingle on the Way 2. Today guys, I will be reviewing you guys a TV series. I will be reviewing you guys the first season of a TV series. That came out last year, you know that. And today, guys, I'll be reviewing you guys the Santa Clauses, uh, the first season of the Santa Clauses. So here we go. Uh, the review starts up in five, four, three, two, one, go. So you guys see the trailer right now going on right now. Trailer, trailer, trailer. You know that, but yeah. So what do I think about the Santa Clauses uh, season one? I think this first season was great. For me, I'm I we I am a fan of the Santa Claus uh, franchise uh, with Tim Allen. I really love uh, those. I really love uh, those uh, their movies. I love his movies that he played as Santa Claus. The third one was okay, but this one for me for me this is a sequel to a the third movie, and oh that in yeah. I really enjoy this film. I, I I do enjoy this first season a lot. There's six episodes, but I'm not going to talk about it all at the So, because I don't want to spoil you guys too much if you guys haven't seen this series yet. And yeah. But of course, guys, let's, let's check out the cast first up, guys. Let's check out the cast and what we have today. Here it is right now, the Santa Claus in Season 1. Start it up with, of course, the obvious one. Tim Allen as Santa Claus slash Scott Coffin. I do enjoy uh, Scott in this move in this season. Uh. Scott uh, become very odd that he really wants to retire, uh, but uh, like he said, like oh I've been sev I've been like oh I've been uh, doing this for nearly twenty over twenty years of my life. Uh. And I went to retire. I went to spend time with my family and all of that. Uh, and that is what uh, Scott is. I really want to retire because my magic is going away because I'm becoming very old uh, and all of that. And yeah. And with Scott, uh, I really love Scott's character because he's like, uh, hey, I'm Santa Claus uh, and all of that. Uh, and I want to retire and spend time with my family. But if you don't know, Christmas, without Scott Coffin as Santa Claus, Christmas is going to be doomed. And all of that. Uh, and all of that. And then when you think about uh, Christmas with this move, this series, uh, and all of that. And then he has to go through a lot in this season, uh, and all of that. He has to get back, uh, and all of that. I'm going to go back to Tim Allen for just a minute. Just a minute, I still have some, there's some more I need to talk about, so, yeah. Next thing we got is Elizabeth Mitchell as Mrs. Claus slash Kalo Coffin. Kalo, for me, she's really good. We enjoy her a lot in the second one, in the third movie. I do enjoy her uh, a lot, uh, and I really enjoy, and I really like uh, Kalo. Uh, I love Kalo. She's really good uh, in this season and all of that, becoming Mrs. Claus and all of the stuff, so yeah. Next thing we got is Austin Kane as Carl, Carl Finn uh, Claus. Carl is Santa's uh, 
Klaus, uh, uh, son. So, Scott has two sons, Charlie and Carl. There is their sons, yeah. I do enjoy Carl. He's a really good character, like, he's really good. Some of us said that Carl might become Santa Claus in the future when he grows up. Because you have pasta, the pasta, and all of that. That's very, very, very fun, and I quite really enjoyed it, and all of that. So, yeah. Next thing we got is Elizabeth Aaron Dick as a son, 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 Oh, I do not want to live to the, the Pope. Carl, he says, Carl says something about, Hey, uh, I do not want to live to the Pope. I want to live to the old world. I want to live in the good world. What is it like out there? Man? And, yeah. And said, uh, she said, I do not want to leave uh, the no Pope. I want to stay in the no Pope. Uh, and all of that. And said, uh, she has a gift, uh, she has uh, a Christmas magic as well. She can talk to animals. Uh, she can talk to a reindeer. She can talk to a horse. She can talk to a lot of things. And yeah. Next thing we got is Devin Bright as Noel. Noel is uh, good. Uh, being a uh, Santa's helper. You know that. He's a good elf. You know that. So yeah. Madina. Laura as Betty, Noel's wife. Betty, Betty is really good. There was one time that she disappeared uh, in like one of the last episodes of like from the last few episodes of season one. But yeah, but I do enjoy Betty and yeah. And then you have Carl Pin as Simon Chucky as Santa Claus. Yeah, Simon, when uh, Scott retired, he passed it down to uh, Simon, which Simon is black. Why would you want to have a black Santa Claus? That doesn't make sense. Santa is white, not black. Like the snow, he's white uh, and he is Santa. And yeah. And all that stuff, so yeah. And if you think about Seta, you have a Corsetta and all of that. And uh, yeah. Simon took over the Christmas industry, uh, making Christmas every day. And decided, why don't we instead do a sleigh? I got drones. Uh, and yeah. He has a business company. He has like his own Amazon. He has his own Amazon. And all of that. And yeah. And then we got Simon's daughter. Polly Red as Grace. You have uh, Simon's daughter Grace, which she said, "No, we do. I do not want Christmas to be every single day." And all of that. And yeah, David and of course David Cumhosey as Bernard. Bernard only appeared in one episode of the series, uh, which I'm like, that's sad. It's so sad you don't really see Bernard uh, pretty much anymore. Unless they make a season 3 and then you decide to bring back Bernard. Uh, that would be pretty awesome. And yeah. And then finally we got Eric Lloyd as Charlie. As just for a quick cameo episode in Florida. And all of that. So. Yeah. So. Yeah. Oh, this episode. Yeah. Pretty much this first season is pretty great. Like I, I, I really enjoyed the of uh, the the Christmases, the Christmases in this movie, and all of that. When Scott and his family went back home, they played a board game. They have a lot to do, and all of that. It's super weird because Kayla is a I think she's like a prisoner. Like she is working for the school. She's working for the school. And uh, Carl met a new girlfriend. 
and then Cinda makes new friends, uh, and yeah, and Scott is all by himself, and yeah, and then, uh, and then, uh, if, if I remember clearly, clearly, Bernard appeared in the fifth episode of this season, uh, telling, telling Scott, you're supposed to be Santa, if you destroy, if Christmas is destroyed, uh, what is it gonna happen? Uh, Scott is taking over, uh, again, of course, Simon, Simon is taking over, uh, Santa's workshop, and he is destroying Christmas, uh, and all of that. Which, that's interesting to think about, because with Santa, it's... Interesting, uh, to think about, and all of that, and, uh, yeah. I don't really hate, uh, I, 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 I don't, I, I don't hate Simon, he's just... He just doesn't know what the tribute of Christmas is, so he decided that uh, all he wants for, all Grace wants for Christmas is that one memory that they had. Because when Grace's mother died, uh, a lot of things have been happening uh, with Simon lately. He decided to open up a, uh, a his own version of Amazon, uh, and he decided to do that in all that. And that's how Christmas was ruined. The Christmas spirit is supposed to be for one day only. And that is always December 25th. If you have Christmas every single day, what is the tribute of Christmas anyway? Of course, it's about uh, Jesus' birth uh, and all of that. It's not about... We have to remember that... You gotta remember that... You gotta remember that Christmas is not about giving... It's not about getting, it's about getting, it's not about getting stuff, uh, and all of that. It's about giving. Uh. Like, if you have to, you guys have to remember, if you go to church, you guys have to remember that, uh, it's not about Santa, and all of that. It's about, uh, Jesus' birth, uh, and all of that. That's why every Christmas day, we celebrate Jesus' birth because Je it's Jesus' birthday. Jesus' birthday is on Christmas Day, and that's what we celebrate. We celebrate Jesus' birthday while, when Jesus was in the manger, when he was under the star, and of course all of that. We don't really know how the Christmas story goes, but it's about giving. That's why God gave his son, Jesus Christ, for us. And then he died for us to save us, to protect us. Jesus died for us to take away all of our sins. And yeah, and not a lot of people doesn't believe in that Christian nation, about that Christian, uh, that Christian, that part of a uh, region, uh, that part of a uh, uh, Christian way, like about that Christian co community uh, and all of that. Uh, people doesn't care too much about we, we engine, uh, we engine, uh, and all of that. Uh, and all the people say, ah, it's about Santa Claus. We gotta remember that Santa. And all that, so yeah. Well, yeah. But again, I quite enjoyed the first season of the Santa Claus. And yeah, I will, I will review the second season later on. Uh, a little bit later on. But yeah, but the Santa Claus uh, season one, I quite really enjoyed it. Uh, it was a great story, a great movie, and a, a, a great TV show with six great episodes. I watched this one uh, the day before Thanksgiving. I watched the show the day before Thanksgiving. You know what? If I remember clearly, I literally watched this film, this series, the all the way through, all season one, all the way through on Christmas and Thanksgiving. Because me and my family didn't have Thanksgiving till Friday, uh, on Black Friday. That's when my big family came and we have a good Thanksgiving meal. And yeah. And with Chris and today, and of course, this video is uploaded on the 19th. We only got like 16, we only got 6 days left until Christmas and all of that. It's, it's coming very fast guys and all of that stuff, so yeah. Again, we really enjoyed uh, the Santa Claus this season well. I do enjoy the Christmas is, I do enjoy the story of all of that related to this show and all of that stuff, so yeah. 
I'm gonna end off this review here, guys. What do I give this review? I'm gonna to give, I'm gonna say to myself, I give this show, a, I give this show pretty much an 8 out of 10. I think this show was very great. I think this is a very great show, and I really enjoyed this first season, so yeah. Find a score at 80%. Uh, A plus to F minus, uh, I mean, critically, I'm gonna give this one an A. I really enjoyed uh, the set of classes for what it is. This first season for me is really great. Everybody, that the whole top family is going to enjoy watching this series. Uh, I know a few people might really enjoy watching it and all of that and all of that stuff. And yeah, and Jumbo, again, it's a great show and I love it and I enjoyed it a lot. Stay tuned guys because the next one will be a Christmas story too. Not the sequel to the original Christmas story, but its own fit. It's DVD sequel uh, being a Christmas story too, which I'm going to be reviewing you guys that tomorrow on the 20th, so stay tuned for that review. So, yeah. I hope you guys do enjoy this review. If you guys have, then hit that like button down below. Let's try to hit this video to five likes if you could do that. That would be amazing and all of that stuff. So, yeah. Also, if this is your first time here, then click that subscribe button down below. I need you guys' help. I'm trying to get this gen channel to 3,000. I'm so sorry about that, guys. But, yeah. I remember I was like somewhere between 16 minutes. But, yeah. But, yeah, guys. Uh, I, I need you guys' help. I'm trying to get this channel to 3,000 subscribers by June 8th, 2024. So, if you guys can help me out, that would be amazing. So, yeah. Also, guys, uh, hit that notification bell to never miss when I upload a video. Also, share this video with your friends and family. And make sure you guys go down below and go subscribe to my two other channels. I need your help on my gaming channel. I'm trying to get my gaming channel to 500 subscribers by the end of the year. Which you guys already have 6... Which you guys already have... Uh, I gotta be good. I I gotta remember my head how much we got left. Uh, you guys only have 12 days left to get this channel to that amount of subscribers. So if you guys can help me out, that would be amazing. So yeah. Also guys, hit that. Also guys, make sure you guys go down below. Go subscribe to my Christian channel. I need your help on my Christian channel. I'm trying to get my Christian channel to... Uh, to... Uh, 3,000 subscribers by the end of by June 8th, 2024. So I'm trying to get both this channel and my Christian channel to the same uh, to the same amount of subscribers. So yeah, my brother creep me out, uh, skill me, skill me half to death. And yeah, and those are some This is supposed to be the Christmas season, not the spooky season. Uh. And, oh, and this episode, yeah. Fixed. Yep. So, yeah, guys. Also, guys, like I said before, guys, help my Christian channel. I'll try to get both this channel and my Christian channel to 3,000 subscribers by the same day, June 8th, 2024. So, yeah. Stay tuned, guys, because the next one is a Christmas story, too. Don't forget to go down below, click that subscribe button down below to join the ninja, to, to join the how to join. The Charlie Sent Ninja Nation Army. And stick around. Go check out more of my other videos. And I'll see my Tim Owen and Santa Claus fans next time. Peace. Ho, ho, ho.